Hi, this is Shane and welcome back to another episode of Antimatter Chemistry. And um, first of all, I want to start out by saying hi to all my new subscribers. Um, this is in, not in part, total, well most of, the, most of the time, down to the very brilliant Ectavink whose channel if you don't if you haven't been watching him you should go and watch him he's a pretty cool youtuber does minecraft and um he gave me a shout out in one of his videos and i got um a, quite a few subscribers from that so thank you very much Hector, and hi to all my new subscribers um and also what did i you probably notice that i've got a hammer in my hand i went ahead and i did a couple of the quests because I wanted the hammer so that I could mine in between episodes and you just got a glimpse of my mine basically I dug down it's a super flat world so bedrock is not too far down and I've been digging out under here because you know you've got the layer of white on top there's what three layers of light grey antimatter three four layers of light grey antimatter and then some more layers of white and that's what I've been mining so let me show you what I've been doing so I don't know why I came all the way over here when I just have to open open my quest book so um, last week we finished chapter one and in, and we started the games, the tiers of gamers, where we had to make the liquidation evaporators, that's it. We had to make the evaporators, you put water in the evaporator and it will give you, oh I don't have any more do I? It will give you mineral salt. And from the mineral salt is where you get different chemicals to give you different colours. So you take the mineral salt, they wanted that I believe for the first, this one they want 64 mineral salt which I did, got two sharpening kits, a crescent hammer and a speedy hopper. The speedy hopper I put on top of my chemical dissolver and I've been putting, nope I'm not pressing shift, I've been putting um, the chemicals in here and it's been breaking it down into sodium chloride iron potassium chloride magnesium lithium sodium uh, more sodium chloride zinc and copper so from copper we've been able to get orange antimatter and that was the next quest I had to get 64 a stack, a stack of orange antimatter, a stack of grey antimatter. Grey antimatter, if you remember, was um, uh, white antimatter around tungsten. Orange antimatter is um, white antimatter around copper. And now the next bit is we have to get pink, black, and red so that's what we're going to do today so red is around iron oxide which is two iron and one and three oxygen so if we got iron 26 and oxygen oxygen we have oxygen okay Okay, how much did I pick up there? Oh, slot filler. I have no idea what that is. So we need the chemical combiner. Iron oxide. We want that recipe. Iron. Oxygen. Pause. We only want eight okay unlock recipe 
and I've put all the antimatter that I've been mining I've put into this chest for easy access so we can leave two there and that will give us a stack of red um, black is carbon do I have any carbon on me? no carbon is... we got some here Eight carbon, is that antimatter? And what was the other one? Carbon, the wanted pink. Pink, not my favourite colour, if I'm to be totally honest. Magne magnesium, okay. And how do you get magnesium? Uh, chemical dissolver from magnesium oxide. Is that something that we have? Mm, no. Okay, how do you make magnesium oxide? From obsidian. You get it from obsidian. But we don't have... Hold on. Um... No, it wants you to make that, so... Okay, so we can't get it from obsidian. Oh no, we've got magnesium. What am I talking about? I'm blind. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Totally blind. Oh, I probably... Oh no, there's some there too. I don't know. I'm totally blind. And what was the other colour we wanted? Okay, we've got all the colours we need. So we get a pink generator and a speedy hopper. Uh, thank you. Light move. Thank you. More red antimatter. And... Okay, more colours. You want 80 aluminium oxide, 80 magnesium oxide and 80 potassium chloride. Can we do that? It says we've, we've got some. Um, aluminium oxide, you've only got one. Potassium chloride. Got 42 there. Potassium chloride. Right. Right, let's take out the antimatter just for a minute. Alright, that can go back in there. So we've got a stack of that. I want 80. Okay, well in that case, 64 and 15 is not 80, 64 and 10 is 74, oh yeah, it is. Um, okay, and what was the other one? Oh no, we don't have enough, we're almost, almost complete. Um, 64 and 10 is 74, and 5 is 79. Really? So we have to break down some more some more of this stuff. Alright, so that should be, yeah. So you can put that back. And what was the other one we were supposed to do? Yeah, my math is disgusting. It doesn't see any magnesium oxide. But magnesium oxide would be magnesium and oxygen. Uh, chemical combiner. Uh, magnesium. Mag. Ox. 
Yeah, magnesium and oxygen, it's a one-to-one -one ratio. Magnesium, oxygen, Magnesium, oxygen. Is that not what I put in? Magnesium, oxygen. Oh, resume. I had it paused. That is the second or third time that it's gotten me. <laughs> I'd forgotten that it was paused and you need to unpause it. Okay, we've got 35 there. We need some more oxygen. I should take out a stack. Uh, where is the oh there it is so how many do we have 35 we need more magnesium so we need more I need to go fill up tanks I wonder if there's an easier way you can I know there probably is an easier way to pipe water into that but I haven't quite worked out what it is yet and I'm sure one of you lovely people will help me out with that because I've been getting tons of really great suggestions and tips not suggestions but tips and hints from you guys which is really cool so um, so yeah I'm sure somebody will be able to point me in the right direction but at the moment you've got to do it all manually which isn't too bad but it can be a bit of a pain but I can see why they gave us the speedy hoppers right you're full and the last one I'm going to have to remember to keep this going so I can get some of these some of this base stuff And last one, right. You got six there. It's not much. Oh, wrong thing. It's not much, but it might get us what we need. One magnesium. No not getting us what we need okay let's put away some of this stuff all right I think I could put away all the rest of this white antimatter I had to make some more um, uh, storage even though we got storage in the last episode all right have we reached our limit we have. Alright, let's just start another one. At this point it's a little bit easier than making making upgrades. But as I was saying, even though we um we got what do you call that stuff? Storage. You need to Oh my mind's gone totally blank. You need energy to run it on and we don't have enough at the moment so it's okay I can use these until we get more energy and then we can look at well shouldn't say more energy but stuff we can run the energy on because at the moment we don't have an unlimited supply of anything so yeah so it's there I'm going to, I've gone with the refined storage because I prefer it and um, yes we need some more tears mineral salt I mean it's cool that we've got both stuff for both refined storage and um, 82 I think it was 82 but I prefer refined storage Uh, is there another way to make magnesium rather than just getting it from the salt 
magnesium. Right. So you can get it from magnesium oxide, obviously. Mag oh, anything with magnesium in it. Mineral salt. Magnesium ingot. Magnesium ore. Uh, magnesium dust. The block. Pink at antimatter. I could. I could take some of the pink antimatter. But I don't know. We've got one from that. And we need to get twice as much. Alright, well let's look and see what else we can do while we're waiting. Um, two blocks of coal from that. Magnesium and aluminium oxide. Uh, we've only got one. So how do you get aluminium oxide? Alumin ox. No, it helps fuck a spell. And again, you get that from whatever that is, cow cowlinite, cowlinite, molinite, obsidian. Ah, but how much aluminium oxide do we need? Because it will give you eight. And I'm pretty sure it wanted like 80. Yeah, 80. So how do we make obsidian? Okay. And it's going towards making obsidian. Alright, so that's not going to work. Redstone. How do we make redstone? And da da da. Redstone dust. Chemical combiner. Iron oxide. And strontium, strontium carbonate. Wasn't that? And now, now I'm going to date myself. Wasn't that? Strontium dog wasn't that um 2000 AD that was one of the comics in 2000 AD pretty sure of it because my brother used to get it and I used to read it when he was finished with it and I'm pretty I'm pretty sure Strontium dog was one of the comics in it and right not seeing well generator none of these none of these dimensions villager traits we have villagers no crafting how do we get um okay Let's have a look, because I've been known to not read stuff. Requires red antimatter. So if I... What is that? Is that a dancing baby? Or a chicken with wings? I don't know. Um, right. It requires red antimatter. So do you... Can you get... Can you... Okay, let's get eight of them. Put in that, and what do we get out? Iron oxide and strontium. Oh, we got some more magnesium. And we... Oh no, that's what we had. So we're getting there slowly. Um, right. Redstone. Combiner. Iron oxide and strontium carbonate. Okay, how do you get strontium carbonate? 
carbonate and strontium carbonate you can get from calcium carbonate Calci carbon and oxygen will give you calcium carbonate oh okay let's see if we've got any more mineral salts and let's shove you in here um, some here, some here okay anything else from you? I don't think so sodium chloride that's um, salt I remember something from chemistry I didn't do it for very long I just know bits and pieces I don't know a lot we just got we got just over a stack it's not too bad let's unlock no can I do that from here now okay this is magnesium oxide mag oxide press A and bookmark it and then we wanted redstone all right let's take you out and we wanted iron oxide and strontium carbonate which is strontium and carbonate which is carbon and oxygen carbon and three oxygen Oxygen, no. All right, carbon and three oxygen. Where's my? It's not going to get us very much. It's got us eleven, and we've only got nine. Oh no. Unlock recipe. Alright, how many do we need before I start making a whole set? 20. Alright, well let's see how much we can get out of this then. It's a one to one, we're not going to get 20. That. I oh know. Hold on. Unlock recipe. We want carbonate. Now we have that. We want that. And carbonate 11. Uh, da, 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 da. Do we have any? No, we don't. I can't even remember where we got the strontium from in the first place. Alright, let's empty out our inventory. Magnesium oxide. Let's put you in here. Sodium chloride. And iron oxide. Let's put you in here. Block of coal. Put you there. And oxygen. You are down here. And I was supposed to lock these drawers. Didn't I get a key? Did I get a key in this one? I can't remember. I might have. Draw controller. Ah, oh, maybe I didn't get a key. I might be I might be imagining that. Okay, right. Chapter 2, we were trying to get magnesium oxide and potassium chloride, no potassium chloride we've done is magnesium oxide and aluminium oxide. Aluminium oxide we've got one of. Let's fill these back up. And I think 
I am going to have to let these run for a little bit because there's nothing else really we can do on camera we're just waiting for all of this to to um, melt up melt up evaporate so what I'm going to do is do a little bit of this in the background and then get back to you when we have everything sorted okay I'm back I am on the last bit with the aluminium oxide and I need the black antimatter in order to get aluminium uh, stack of 64 we want 32 I want half of that um, to get the stuff for the redstone I had to um, dissolve the red antimatter so I guess there was a reason why they gave you extra so that you can get stuff I didn't really want to but I did I also found out that to get beetroot seeds you can put in um, beetroot seeds triglycerides sucrose and iron oxide you get beetroot seeds and then if you dissolve the beetroots you can you get sucrose and iron oxide I believe hold on did I dissolve the ones that I had I can't remember I've got one left yeah you can get back sucrose and iron oxide so um so yeah I've discovered another crop and what was I doing? I wanted aluminium. 15, we got carbon, tungsten, sucrose from the beetroot. Aluminium oxide. 2 and 3. So I thought I would just jump in and say that. But I've got the other two. It took me a while, but I've got the other two. And I just need the aluminium oxide. So I will see you guys again in a bit. So I am back. I had to unlock recipe. I had to turn black antimatter. Break down, sorry, not turn. I had to break down black antimatter to get aluminium. And then I had to get some more oxygen, which I got from trees. And now I have everything that I need to make aluminium oxides. Manganese, I didn't. That's not it? No, let's try this right. Alright. Press A to bookmark it. Shift there. And we need that and that. But how many do we need? I can't remember. I might not have enough oxygen. We have more oxygen. I don't have enough. Really? Oh, good grief. Because I think I need 80, isn't it? Yeah. We need 80. So let's make some more. Okay, I'm back. I'm pretty sure. 64 and 16. That is 80. It says we don't have 80. Last time this happened, I had to open a chest. That's very strange. Because it happened with the um, the magnesium oxide. It said I didn't have it, but I did. And I had to, when I opened a chest just to check something, it um, it went through. So that's pretty strange, but it's done. So we now have 80 aluminum oxide, aluminium oxide. 80 magnesium oxide and 80 potassium chloride and let's get our rewards so we get a basic energy cell an iron wand and two more iron sharpening kits and in the next episode actually what do we need to make obsidian obsidian eight magnesium oxide 8 potassium chloride 
Okay, we need lots of stuff that gives you one obsidian. So I'm pretty sure if we take everything that we just made, it would give us 10 obsidian that we need. One more, we just want one more, just one more. Yes. There you go. Pause, unlock recipe. Awesome. And we finish that bit. And for that we get a diamond pickaxe and 16 obsidian breakers. Right click an obsidian block to instantly harvest obsidian. Okay. And the next thing is set home. Now would be a good time to use the set home command before you wander away from your base. Okay. T slash set home. And we're done. So, this is where we finish. Definitely where we finish for today. So we've made lots of oxides. Lots of colours, lots of pretty stuff. I did the redstone as well. Did I say that? I can't remember. Seems like that was ages ago. Did the redstone as well. Oh, this was the furnace that I was there thinking we've done it, but we haven't. So yeah, this is the other one we need to make, but I will probably do that off camera. Diamond pickaxe, right. And go to hell. Go to the dimension. We need to make a flint and steel. We will worry about that in the next episode. In the next episode, we will go to the nether and just see what's there. We'd make string, green antimatter, lava bucket. Any one of those three. Hopefully all three, but we'll see how it goes. So, thanks for watching. I hope you have liked what you've seen this week. Please like, comment and subscribe. It really helps to grow my channel. And I will see you in next week's episode. Okay, thanks for watching. Bye-bye.